Dear Jasmine, Dear Jasmine. Dear Jasmine. Dear Jasmine. Dear Jasmine, I wonder if this love is everlasting. I promise not to treat you like your last one. Hi, babes. Hi, boo boos. Hi, darlings. Hi, guys, and welcome back to another video. Uh, uh, another video. Uh, uh. So, I don't even need to give a long intro. You already know what this is. So, today's hair is from Arabella Hair. As you can see, they were kind enough to send me a 22 inches wig. I'm going to show you guys the wig in a second. But the bag also came with this little card right here. And then this little purse. I guess it has some few stuff in here. Oh, lashes. So they sent me lashes. Um, oh, edge band. That's good to lay those edges. Actually, yeah, to lay the lace rather. And then an edge brush as well. A nice little clip. And then they sent me wake up. So we're gonna be installing this wig. I don't know how it's going to go, but let me show you the hair first. Okay, wait, hold on. Right? I know, I know. Okay, this is that's the exact thing I was thinking because I don't really like wearing color because I don't know to me it doesn't really look good on me so I always just stick to like black and don't really do anything else but they insisted on sending me this hair for me to try I guess maybe they think it's gonna look good on me I'm not sure but we're gonna put it on anyway so like I said this is 22 inches it is a frontal it's an HD frontal it did not come bleached it didn't come bleached so I had to bleach it myself which is annoying like can you just do everything and just send it so I don't have to? And I also had to go in and pluck a lot more. It was like a little bit, like a little bit plucked, but I had to go in and pluck more. So I did and everything is just like ready to go. I already straightened it because I didn't want to waste time shooting this video and kind of just like laid it out a little bit. I don't know if you guys can see, but this is so long like so far i like the texture of the hair and i kind of like the colors a little bit i'm just not sure it's gonna look good on me i don't know so we're gonna wing it and see but yeah as you can see i have bleached it i don't know if you can see it hold on i've bleached it and plucked it like yeah it's looking really really nice i can't wait to put it on so enough rumbling let's just jump right into the video if i sound funny it's because i am congested and i have a cold okay so let's put that aside but yeah let's let's get into this video before i even get started i have already done my board cap method i always do it before i start my install just so the video is not so long don't laugh at my head if you do you're gonna go to hell so i have already done it as you can see and i use this like really really light wig cap that i have been seeing a lot and i had a few they didn't send me that one they sent me like the regular one but i use this one because this one is pretty breathable so i don't really sweat a lot i'm gonna look like i don't even know what i'm going to look like but i better look like an instagram body by the time i'm done okay better Tell you guys what i'm doing so i don't know why they put the lace all the way to my ear but it is covering my ear so i'm gonna have to cut this part out so i can see my ear so that's what i'm doing right now i'm just cutting it it's looking like oh it's actually fine i thought the back was going to hang i can finally do this and put the hair behind me like that so that's what I was doing <laughs> I'm always excited to put on a new wig to be honest I don't know it's just like new hair new me I'm so lucky like I always say I'm so lucky to have um, these brands that I work with like even decide to reach out because there are a lot of people that do hair tutorials a lot of people a lot of people you don't need to even watch mine because there's tons and tons and tons 
of videos. Okay, so now my ear is all on that side too. And I already cut this part because like I'm kind of going for a style here. I used the scissors. This see how it's like zigzag to cut that part so I don't cut it straight. I don't know, so I saw someone do it and I bought it. That's all. That's all the explanation. But so far it's been good, so I've been using it to trim just this part. So okay. This might actually come out really nice. I don't know. I don't know yet, but I feel like it's going to. So I'm gonna use this eyebrow pencil to mark where exactly I'm gonna put the glue. person did this she pinned the wig to her own hair like this yeah okay so the hair will not the wig will not fall that's an interesting trick <sighs> so the way I positioned it is where it's gonna stay I love it I love it questions that I have seen in my comments um, it's just a few uh, someone asked me if wearing so many wigs doesn't affect my edges it does you just like I've been wearing wigs for let's say three years now and 
at first i didn't know how damaging it can be to your edges but then i've also realized that like if you're somebody who wears wigs a lot you just you just have to accept the fact that the glue is going to affect your edges at some point and yes definitely um my edges are thinning out but that's okay because i like to cut my hair it doesn't really bother me like if i feel like i want to go back to like doing my perm cuts before that's what i was doing before i'm just going to cut my hair and then go it again that's not really a problem but now it's not like it's not like it's so bad but it's obvious like it's there it that it definitely thins out your edges and um so yeah you just have to be careful how you take off your wigs um how long you keep them in um yeah you just have to take care and be gentle with your edges and just make sure that you're not really like putting a lot of force on your edges and it's gonna be okay it's gonna be fine another question is someone asked me how i maintain the way like how do i even keep it on for more than say two days and that's because every time i'm going to bed i have a bonnet on and my bonnet is in such a way that you see it has like an edge thing so i don't really have to put like an edge band or anything like that like i i just use my bonnet and i put it on and then i tighten just this part because you can adjust it in the back so i bought this bonnet from amazon uh, for those of you that would want to check it out i'm gonna put the link in my bio so yeah there's that and then i just go to bed and it also has like satin in here so it doesn't like cause the wig to be frizzy but um yeah i don't like to put on a wig and then take it off like in a short time it doesn't make any sense to me so i'd rather just like keep it on for a while till like it starts getting old and then it's time for me to change it i don't remember any other questions that i was asked um if i remember i'm gonna answer it but <clears throat> Let's get back to this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We're looking kind of good. We're looking kind of good. So I'm just gonna cut the lace and then we can keep going. This is kind of I mean you can see it, you can definitely see it, but we're gonna blend it better. But so far. So far, it's not looking terrible, okay? I need to go in because not the entire lace is laid. You can see this part is like lifting and this part as well. So we're really gonna try and get that part like here too, in front. So here.
then wait, why do I actually like this? Wait. Take out the foundation brush and just go over it. Try and add the hairline more. So I've been contemplating if I should do edges and I think I will do edges. Something little, nothing too serious. So I'm just gonna take some hair here and just create some edges. Don't know, I kinda like the look without edges. But I'll just do it. Let's do it so I'm less insecure because it's obviously a wig. I wasn't so sure. Even when I was done and I hadn't even done the baby, I said, mm, I don't know if this fits me, but I like it much more with baby hair. Like, I like it. I prefer it with baby hair. And that's how we're going to keep it with some baby hair. Just going to brush it more. Ah, oh, yes! 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 I like the way I have like tucked it behind my ear. Oof, I don't know why this part of the baby hair. Oh, I don't know, but we're gonna have to leave it like that because I can't be bothered. So yes, this is the finished product. Thank you guys for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Once again, this hair is from Arabella. So there's gonna be an exclusive discount code in my description. So check that out i don't know what percentage is gonna be but it is there so just apply it and see how much it's gonna be but yeah that's the end of today's video if you're new to my channel and sweetheart you watch this tutorial maybe you don't even want to wake maybe honestly maybe you don't even have one maybe you didn't need to watch this video but you still did thank you you're the best you're the best like i don't have to explain because i know some of you just watch this watch my hair tutorials religiously without having one wig is just for the support like i don't even know what i did to deserve all that but i really appreciate it you have no idea okay i love you i love you from the bottom of my heart <laughs> okay i'm gonna just go ahead and leave because i'm waiting for my best friend to come pick me up yeah so i'll see you guys in another video i love you so much bye i'm feeling myself bye <laughs>